What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the first video of 2020. I'm really damn excited about this one, so let's just kind of hop on in. I've uh, got some new RAM for my computer that I'm gonna go install, so while I'm doing that, let's have a quick little word from the sponsor. Okay, so I'd like to take a quick minute to thank today's sponsor. That's something that I thought I would never say. Well, I've had a lot of people approach me in the past to want to sponsor my videos, but none of them ever really made sense, and this falls perfectly into place. So thank you to DistroKid for sponsoring this video. DistroKid is essentially a service that allows you to put music into online stores and services because you know there's a plethora of streaming services nowadays. So say you're a musician like myself, now there's like, you know, Spotify, iTunes, Apple Music, YouTube, Pandora, TikTok, name, yeah. all these different services and you don't know how to get your music onto these. Well, that's essentially what DistroKid does is it's a one-stop shop website that allows you to upload your music onto all those services. So once you come onto the thing here, gives you the options of where you want to upload everything, what streaming services, gives you all the back end stuff of all your album art, all the uh, album info stuff, lyrics you can upload. Takes out a lot of the back end work for us as musicians and helps us basically just be able to get our music out to the listeners and to everybody's little ear biscuits. Make sure to check out DistroKid. It's only $19.99 for the year. They were nice enough to give me a link to give you guys 7% off your first year. So use the link distrokid.com slash VIP slash Bigfoot Life and you'll get 7% off your first year. Uh, I'll put that link in the description down below. Make sure to check out DistroKid. It's Extremely awesome, and thank you again, DistroKid, for sponsoring this video. You guys rock. Anyways, let's get on with the video. Okay, so we're freaking back. We're in the future. 2020. That sounds really weird to say. So much has gone on already, and I can't believe we're already through January, pretty much. Like, time is a beast. I figured I would hop on in and make a little update video rather than letting this dwindle on longer and longer and make it harder to make the next video because I do have a lot of content I want to start making again. So yeah, let's just hop on into the big news is that I'm finally recording the Alpha Tryon album. I'm in the scratch track process right now of building everything together and putting together all the arrangements and stuff and making sure everything is kind of like the way I want it to be and actually a lot of the tracks I've never even heard fully fleshed out with bass. And uh, yeah, it's just, it's really damn exciting. So, I mean, for those of you who didn't know, music was my life for freaking ever. So I've finally been back to playing uh, guitar again. And it's been like a couple years of the process of getting my hands working and stuff again. Cause I, I literally stopped playing for probably like three years, even though I played for probably a good 15, 20 years before that. Jeez, that's making me sound old. So it feels really good to be back playing again, back to playing every single day. Uh, my hands, uh, I'm pretty confident in them again, so I'm at a point where it's time to track the album. So the Alpha Tryon album, that uh, was always the name of like my solo project music that I wrote like freaking a decade ago. It means it means a lot to me that music, and it still it still does to this day. So it's like yeah, it's about time to finally record the album. Survival means invention is the name of the, the album. So. Just like a little backstory, like I've literally been playing guitar and music with my life since I was 15 years old. Played in a handful of bands that I progressed in their seriousness and eventually ended up touring across Canada with one of them. But yeah, I always kind of felt a little guilty for putting the Alpha Tryon stuff on the back burner, but it turned out for the best because I'm now in a place where I've got my own little, little studio room where I can kind of disappear into and I feel comfortable and inspired to make music again. So let's get this album out and this album done. It feels so good to finally have the music out for you guys to listen to, but then also to kind of have that uh, subconscious space freed up again to start working on new music. So yeah, I'm really excited about that. And uh, I'm really, uh, really, really damn excited for y'all to get, start hearing this uh, material. Okay, well, I suppose I should give you a little taste of where everything's at right now, uh, rather than just talking about it. Needless to say, I am stoked. So yeah, I'm really excited to start showing you some progress on this stuff, um, let alone to finally get the finished product out after like a decade of writing this music. So 
really stoked on that and that's pretty much uh, what I've been working on in the background of things as far as music and I've got a bunch of other things I've been working on here too. But speaking of that, one thing I really want to change this year, I'm really always just trying to better myself and work towards improving everything and one of my biggest faults is always being really stubborn and not asking for help when I need it. So um, yeah, being self-employed, doing everything on my own, it's really easy to get behind on things. So. I've got a bunch of new merch and stuff. If you guys want to support me, support the channel, support my music, um, anything that I do. So with my main company, BC Plugs, which is how I make a living, which is these uh, big old things, my ears, that everybody's always like, that's BC Plugs. And I've been running that company for almost eight years now, so we have a bunch of new stuff. For the winter season, we got these badass new windbreakers. Nice little embroidered patch on there. And the badass thing about these is they are actually champion jackets. So this is like the coolest part about this jacket. You take the pouch. Yeah, it folds up into this tiny little pouch. Sick windbreakers. More with the box logo theme. We've got a nice, just basic gray crew neck that has a nice little embroidered patch on the left side of the chest. And then of course, you've probably seen me wearing it in other videos. We've got various versions of the shirt. This one's just a black long sleeve. The comfiest shirts ever, I swear. And then the one thing that I'm so damn excited about is we finally have a basics line. So this is actually a long tee with a nice little embroidered logo on the left side of the chest, classic cross logo. If you're like me at all, you like layering your t-shirts and uh, if you're like me at all and super tall, you need long tees. So I've now got basic white long tees for, for layering and stuff. So part of the basics line, the most exciting part is it's time to be comfy boys in 2020. Cause we have our own sweatsuits and oh my God, it's so damn comfy. Yeah, so we got basic hoodies with a little embroidered thing on it, but the most exciting, and we actually have sweatpants now with our own little embroidered logo on them. I'm so damn excited. And this shit's so comfy too. But yeah, like I say, I'm gonna be not afraid to ask for some help and give you guys some sweet things in return. So album's coming soon, working on that. Check out the Facebook, uh, check out my Instagram, pick up some merch if you wanna help me out. And of course, if you got plugs, let me make you something awesome. I've got some other really awesome projects coming up soon. I wanna start doing a, like a little guitar corner or hot rodding guitars or, um, I don't know the name of it yet, but essentially I'm gonna start taking some of my old guitars and fixing them up. Uh, bring them back to life, maybe even buy some shitty guitars, put some new parts on them, hot ride the heck out of them. First up on the list is my Washburn HM. That was like my main guitar for so freaking long that now has a broken neck for the second time. So we'll get this one, ooh, dreadlocks. We'll get this one fixed up, brought back up to life in a new video and uh, we'll start going from there. Like I say, just wanted to bring you guys back up to speed, show you some of the new things I've been working on and uh, yeah, damn excited. And thanks again to DistroKid for helping us out uh, being the first sponsor. So yeah, make sure to hit up those guys in the link and uh, see you guys in the next video. Peace.